WTFNN. Headline news update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials up 41, NASDAQ down 12, S&P's flat, and we're going to be coming into uh, the close, folks, and you get option expiration, so you're going to get a little volume uh, in at this close. Gold contract, gold contract trading up $4.70 at $14.01 an ounce. We have silver down 17 cents, $15.31 an ounce. Light sweet crude, $56.65 a barrel. Notes and bonds, you get the 10-year note down 17 ticks, trading 154 Trading 127.16, the 30 year off one full point and three ticks at 154.20. Now, that, uh, you know, you, you have some price here, but the bottom line, folks, is that you are pulling back with light volume into strength. Okay, so the bottom line is that note, notes as well as bonds continue to want higher price. Uh, the 10 year, the 30 year right now is pulling back with uh, 289,000 contracts, and the bottom line is that you're pulling back into 365. 10 years, same setup. Uh, inside the metals market, what's moving that metals market right now, and I expect it's going to keep moving higher. Why? Because this is the first time since last October that you actually have follow through to the downside inside the dollar index. So what we have out here today, and you still have summer trading, but the bottom line is that the dollar index does have volume once again on the way down. Um, we've come down three times, three days in a row. And you get an expansion of volume now. First day, uh, Wednesday, we are coming down with 29,000. Yesterday, you come down with 25,000, and you're at 28,000 right now. So good old King Dollar uh, wants to make its way down to the 94 number. We'll see uh, if, in fact, it breaks that 94 number. That, no doubt, is what's giving the metals contract room to go higher. S&P's bottom line is that you get a sideways flat market out here. Right now, you get 49 million shares trading in the S&P. Yesterday, we did uh, 116. You're going into this uh, 71 out here. What I do expect we're going to see is that as we're coming into this close, you're going to get some volume into this close with option expiration. When we take a look at the indice volume, indice volume out here, uh, you're at 624 inside the NYSE. That's already big volume. So we're going to get some real juice coming in the, into this close. Inside the NASDAQ composite, you're already at 1.4 billion. So that is going to ratchet up to somewhere about the 2 billion mark. Stay right there, folks. Uh, next 60 minutes trading coming back, coming right back. Dow Industrials right now up 38. NASDAQ is down 12. S&P's a flat. Come right back.